Hi everyone, welcome. Today I'm going to be giving you a look at a Vera Series 7400 craft form adjustable torque screwdriver. First of all, in the name of disclosure, I paid for this product with my own funds and I have no affiliations with the manufacturer. Also, it's raining outside, which it does almost every morning here in the jungle, so uh, please excuse the noise if you can hear the rain. So, Vera makes a number of models of torque screwdrivers uh, covering a torque range all the way down from 0 0.02 Newton meters up to 8.8 .8 Newton meters. And they also make ESD variants, electrostatic discharge variants, which have a yellow colored handle instead of green. And they also make models with both metric and imperial units. This particular guy I have here covers a torque range of 0 0.3 Newton meters to 1.2 Newton meters. And that's a torque range which is appropriate for screws in the range of M2 to M3, i.e. a 2 millimeter to 3 millimeter thread size. So the screwdriver only allows you to gauge torque in the tightening direction. It does not work in the reverse direction. So let me go over how to adjust the torque setting since it's not entirely obvious and the manual is lacking. So if you look closely, there is an arrow on one side of the handle, that white uh, triangular arrow, and it's only on one side. So you keep this side facing towards you. And there is a plastic collar at the front of the handle. You pull that back. Now you may need to rotate the main part of the handle while you're pulling back to get it to come back. And then the next step is you rotate the main part of the handle. Now rotating in the clockwise direction increases the torque setting. If you look closely at the shaft here, there are markings on two sides of it, on opposite sides of it. The scale is alternating. So on one side, there's 0 0.3, and then on the back side of it is 0 0.35, but you always keep this white arrow facing towards you. So right now, it's set at 0 0.3 Newton meters. So if you pull the collar back and then rotate clockwise 180 degrees, it's now set at 0 0.35 Newton meters. And the numerical markings on this scale are above the line for the marking, corresponding to the marking. And you set the forward uh, most portion of the black plastic uh, actually on the line uh, with the number part above it. So I will insert a photo now of the screwdriver set to 0 0.4 Newton meters. So let me simulate actual use of the torque screwdriver and what happens when the torque value is reached. So here I have just a quarter inch hex bit. To insert the bit, you slide it in and apply pressure, and then this collar will click back. And to remove the bit, you just push forward on the collar, and the bit comes out. So insert, apply pressure, remove, slide forward on the collar. So. In the other hand here, I am going to hold this driver fixed and I'm going to apply torque in the clockwise direction with the torque screwdriver. And when the torque value is reached, you will hear that click and the handle will jump forward. So click, click, click. So that means, means the torque value has been reached. So I think that about sums it up. Oh, finally, as with most torque tools, you should store them at the lowest torque setting to uh, prevent the occurrence of spring set. Okay, well, thank you for watching. And if you have any comments or questions, please comment below. And also, if you could like and subscribe and share and do all that, I'd really appreciate it. Again, thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye now.